did it with our hair. Uh -uh. Nope. I sure don't. Because we're going to Beverly Hills. Now, if I'm going to do good at that audition, we got to look like stars. Hey you guys, it's Reese coming back to you with another video. If you don't know who I am, my name is Reese. This is my beauty channel where we come to slay, especially on a budget. And today I got another budget wig for you guys. This is under $50. This hair. Yeah this hair so if you want to know more about how i applied this wig and my thoughts on this wig then stay tuned hey you guys so i got a new hair review and a hair tutorial Ooh. so yeah i got another hair review and a hair tutorial for you guys um i'm gonna start with the review put some b-roll in of how i you know plucked this unit how i received it so i did buy it off of amazon uh, it literally came, I have Amazon Prime, so it literally came the next day I bought it, like the next day. No, I bought it on a Wednesday and it came on a Thursday. I didn't start plucking it until Friday. Here, it's a Synthetica. It's really soft. I saw the reviews and all that before I got this wig because I didn't want to buy like a Synthetica and it wasn't going to look too good. I really, really liked how it was already um, plucked in the front and the knots were already bleached. Um, I did have to re-pluck the hair because it was plucked in the front, but then as you see that the, this, um, my lace towards, after the plucked areas, the lace was very, very thick with hair, so I had to pluck it down to make it a little bit more natural. Yeah, so um, it is a lace front wig. It's a Synthetica, it's in the color silver. I do have a little bit of brown, um, on the roots because i did use a my tinting lace method so what that is is i got some brown dye and mixed that in with water and sprayed it on the lace it kind of got onto the hair a little bit but it's not noticeable as you can see um this hair like this hair is so soft it's it seems like it looks is way more cooler than if I got like a 613 hair and dyed it silver. It gets frizzy really fast though. So just be aware of that. You're gonna have to carry a comb everywhere you go with you just to comb out the little knots that it has. It doesn't shed as much as a Synthetica would. So I think it's really good on the shedding part. Um, see I got like three strands so I guess it's kind of it does shed so I can't really say it's really good on the shedding when I first got it before I plucked it it wasn't shedding like that so I think when you know you manipulate the wig you uh pluck it and do all that um manipulation and put products on it um then it starts to shed um, it's very, it feels very hydrated. It doesn't feel dry at all. It's not shiny, so it doesn't look hella synthetic on my head. It looks very natural. I was kind of scared to try this hair color without dark roots because without dark roots, I look, I don't know. I just, I don't know. When I first got it, it looks like I'm the old girl from Lord of the Rings. Um, I feel like I'm at like a cosplay, like event but I had to put my magic to it I did pluck and um, use makeup to hide the lace I did use my new lace glue I did do the mesh cap method let me rewind I did use the mesh cap method just because my hair my real hair is black so when you wear very light colors like blonde or any other different colors it's highly recommended that you put the mesh cap method just so you don't see any like of your real hair because as you can see if I lift it up you can see dark root or my dark <laughs> my my black hair basically so I'm gonna um, probably manipulate it to where I can wear it up in a ponytail and I really like how it looks on me it's something new totally different I do do the ash blonde look um, but without 
with dark roots so this kind of has like an ashy blonde look to it it's silver i've seen so many girls on amazon rock it on the reviews so i was like you know if they can rock it i can rock it so, it was under 50 bucks you guys i spent 45 dollars on this hair um let me see what this hair is called so this hair is called sapphire wigs in a gray silvery white color um that i received it's 45 dollars and 50 cents it is amazon prime you guys um it's a 6 by 13 lace front wig you guys and it is i feel like big head friendly because my head is on the small side and i had to put the straps um i had to strap it up real tight just because it was a little big like i had to cut a lot of lace off um so it is big head friendly for those that got the big heads it's big head friendly and for those that got small heads um just use a strap or try to add an elastic band to secure your wig um, i did use the bmb lace glue you guys i do have a review on this lace glue it's amazing um yeah you should wear it by the remover as well if you're gonna use that lace glue and my lace glue tutorial and my review is somewhere up here yeah, so sapphire wigs they did they thing like i would definitely like buy wigs from them um most definitely like different color wigs they have a range of different colors i just wanted to try a safer color which is gray so yeah I've, so ladies i have fast forward a lot of the tutorial of how i applied this wig and how i plucked it i do do the same technique as all my wigs in my videos so i do have a three-part series that is very very detailed is three videos each of me talking about how i customize my wigs and how i apply them i did use a new glue so i also have a review and how i remove and apply that wig with the glue very detailed in my last video so i have all types of videos you guys so if you're just looking for that very detailed explanation of how i apply that wig just you know look in the description sis i got you it might be a different color but it's the same it's the principle okay so as you can see i'm just adding my edges i do this all the time i have so many videos so yeah i sped it up i just wanted to let you guys know i got a new wig under 50 dollars it's popping it's cute i just want to show you like a quick version of how i applied this wig i am using my 24 edge tamer edge control by eben new york ebin yes sis this stuff is the goat so yeah, I basically cut my hair super short and ladies edges, gotta lay them. So yeah, I have so many of you guys on my Instagram trying to see how I laid this wig. If you want more detail, check it out in my description. And yeah, let me know how you guys like this look. It's something new, something fresh. The only new thing I did about applying is making my homemade tint spray for my lace i think that is something you guys should invest in and that's basically it you guys i'm just gonna let this video play and finish my edges and apply makeup i love you guys so much let me know down in the comments what your favorite look of me is or if you have any ideas of what colors i should try next i am so down for it so let me know